See something that said, take a look at what happened. Oh. Hey everyone, welcome back to the Spotlight News. Today we are reporting this news from the Spotlight News. Don't forget to share, like, and sub subscribe to this YouTube channel as we give you the latest and trading news. Here we come from America as we woke up this day early in the morning as we go to our notice that Mr. Donald Trump, the president of America, as he was addressing in a, in a community during the campaign, blood started flowing all over the world, but it is... It is alleged, as you see in that video, the infant video, that we are still investigating on what is really happening on Donald Trump's side because he was taken in the condition whereby blood was flowing all over his tears. Though news reporting from that side, they are saying someone who did this all the shooting because bullets were fired all over the world, as all over the, all over the place. Bullets were many, were many, but people are saying maybe there were hired snipers around, around who were shooting in this scene. Because if you're seeing, he even lost his shoes. Because in that current video you've seen in front, the Mr. Donald Trump was asking for his shoes. He was like, "Let me first get my shoes." Other bodyguards were trying to take him out because after the scene and shootings with all the world people are saying that according to the scene the person who did this all the shooting all the snipers who really shot were some meters meters away from the scene so as the people were still listening to the campaignings shootings were all over the all over the place and Donald Trump had to hide himself down and the bodyguards had to do their work by coming and guiding him. Some putting all putting on blade proofs to guide him so that they can lead him away. They can take him away. So we are still investigating whether in what condition he is. But if you to look in this video, I think he got some shooting around the ears because blood was coming out of the ears blood blood was flowing out and we are we are really still investigating what's really happening because we don't know whether he got another injury because they didn't let us know what really is happening but what i know is he's in is now in a safe hands because the bodyguard did what they can so that they can take out they can take him out of the place where the shooting happened so guys i think this is so bad. This is so bad. I don't know what I can tell this, but this is not good news for America. That side of American, our brothers, Americans and sisters, it's not a good scene to see, but we don't really know what's happening as we are still investigating because even the Larry 
ended immediately upon there when the shooting started everyone had to go down and i think this saved mr donald trump though we are still investigating what really happened did they shoot that did the shooting person that ear or did it go in front but according to, uh, according to what you see in the video with all his the pain he was going through he had to stand again and raise the hand to be a strong man the sign of a strong man as you see in this video in this audio around going around so guys don't forget to click the like share button and as you comment because we are bringing more news we are still investigating more about donald trump's situation that side of america and what is really happening that side of america because i don't think it's a good sign for the citizens of america it's a good sign for the people it's a good sign because i think if they are doubling security for Mr. Donald Trump, they should redouble it because this is so bad for the, that side. Because according to the reporting news of a sniper, which is not yet confirmed, we are coming back on more updates and telling you more about the Donald Trump situation. Yeah, don't forget this is for the news, new number one news reporter and all the trending news and everything. Let's get back to you. Bye bye. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye.